we just arrived at Lake Colorado City State Park in Texas. It's near Colorado City, Texas. And uh, we're in Site 34. <clears throat> and the lake is uh, right behind the rig here. 50 amp hookup, water. It's 50-30. Picnic table and pavilion and a fire pit. Making our way back east. A little playground out back pretty park. Got some flowers blooming. Let's walk down the lake, see what's going on. We have a Texas State Park Pass. I had made a reservation on uh, Reserve America. Sight unseen, it's our first time in this campground. Site 30, Mesquite Loop, looks uh, looks fairly flat. Mine had just a little dip to it. Wouldn't have been, it's not a problem, but uh, surely wouldn't have been a problem if I was disconnecting, but I'm only here for one night. So, We'll live with not perfectly level. But site 30 looks uh, like we would have been pretty much level if we would have had that one. There's another nice site in uh, Mesquite Loop. Site number 25. And it's surely long enough to put a big rig in there and leave it hooked up. Nice looking site. Well, there's a proud Texan for you. Let's uh, check out, uh, I think they have a fishing pier, fishing ramp. Let's go down and check that out. Well, I don't know whether it's out of season, whether it's out of repair, I'm gonna have to ask them. But that's the fishing dock, um, boat dock, here at Lake Colorado State Park. Lake Colorado City State Park. Really pretty. out see what else is there. A little walking trail skirts the lake here. Looks like I picked a good stopover. And back to the rig. Check in with Melody. Let's see if she wants to go for a walk around the campground. Look how pretty this campground is. We're in the third week of March. And uh, there's a lot of sites available.
we're in what they call the Rolling Hills Camping Loop. This site is flat. You got a lot of space. Site 63. Uh, it's only 30 amp, but I'm gonna write it down for a backup. It's, uh, it's a nice flat site. A lot of these are sloped. Yep, third amp. You got a lot of space, a lot of space between sites. It's a real pretty campground. Okay, site 63 goes down for a backup. I, my preference is 50 amp. If you're gonna pay for a site, you might as well get 50 amp if you don't get it. Our house and dumpsters. Milo's checking it out. I think we found one here, number 77. I usually don't like these half moon deals, but this, the way it's positioned, it's not a half moon. You can pull in, pull right back out. Got your water. Fifty amp hookups. goes on the uh, camping map. Site 77. 50 amp hook up. Water. Plenty of room. In and out. Now we're working our way back to our rig. You can see my rig in the trees there. Hey, uh, Texas. Gotta give uh, Texas credit, they didn't close their state parks for the coronavirus thing. These campgrounds are self-contained. Pretty well dispersed. As long as you're not congregating at like a community pool and stuff like that reason why you need to close the campground. There's the rig. And Melody is summoning. So let's see what she wants. Oh, she wants me to go take a look at the dump site that we need to utilize tomorrow. So I guess you can just pull up on the way out and access it from both going in and going out. Two different sets of dumps. Water's not for drinking. I don't need to turn around or anything. I just come straight out, dump the tanks, leave the garbage in the dumpster, and out you go. I'm like it. Texas State Parks. Now this is the restroom in our loop. You got some extra parking and 
I wonder how much space you have inside of the loop. Colorado City State Park. We are in the Mesquite Loop. You are right there. And we took a walk up into the Rolling Hills. The one I didn't go to is Lake, the Lake View Camp. Okay, I just talked to a park ranger who was driving by, so I asked him about that fishing pier. And he said uh, the park is working toward getting it replaced. So, for the time being, it's closed. Uh, so that answers that question. And I guess there used to be a power plant across the way. You can see it here in a few minutes. And it used the water in this lake, but they closed the power plant. And uh, so you have a state park here. But that, I didn't know what that was. It looked like some kind of industrial business off in the distance by a water tank. And uh, anyhow, they said that was a. That was a power plant, but it's no longer in use. So. All right. Let's get uh, dinner cooking. I'm real happy with this state park. Lake Colorado City State Park. Texas.